for a few more more years. Now I just want to give you a little summary, summary of Kong from the perspective that I've had, I've had over the years. He was born in Mona Lina, Castle Mahan, and he was in, in 1888, for those of you who like, who like putting down dates. Fa his father was Michael Colbert of Ate, and his mother was Nora McDermott of Cora Clare. When he was, third, when he was uh, three years of age, the family moved to Ate. His father farmed part of the old Colbert lands at Temple Ate. He attended school in Ate. He also attended Kilcolman National School for a short period while he was staying with relatives at Ballaston. As a young man, he took a keen interest in national affairs. Obviously, the fermentation was taking place. Record tells us that he went to Dublin when he was 15 and stayed with one of his sisters. He attended secondary school at St. Mary's Place and at O'Connell Schools. It is reported that on leaving school, he was offered a job in customs and excise, but declined. He declined the offer because he was required to take a note of allegiance to the Crown. Instead, he took a job as a clerk at Kennedy's Bakery in Parnell Street and remained there until the rising. Well, at Kennedy's, he joined the IRB. He personally employed an army drill instructor to teach him military drill. In 1909, when Fina Aaron was founded, he joined at the first meeting and a few days later was drilling the first Fina squad. A year later, he offered his services as drill instructor at Spolena, Hodrick Pierce School. Pierce found it hard, found it difficult to get someone who could teach drill through Irish. It is reported that he refused to take any payment for his services. The work was <coughs> undertaken for the national cause. He continued as Pierce's drill master and close friends up to the rising. Thank you. 